Hey guys, this is Mike Jones and today I'm going to do a tutorial that will show you how to get new tracks for NASCAR Racing 2003 season. And I'll show you four different websites where you can get some tracks and I'll, I'll download a couple and show you how to get them going and where to put them and everything to do. So let's get into it. So the first website, this is the best website for realistic tracks. They don't have any fictional tracks is uh, nr2kweebly.com. If you type in nr2003 on Google, it will always be the first one that comes up. So uh, yeah, this track or this website, it doesn't have any downloads on the actual website. It re redirects you to different sites like all three of these ones. But I'll go over all three websites because I believe they are more or less the most important ones. In fact, that one's probably the most important. But uh, yeah, so. I wanted to get a Speedway because I wanted to get a Rockingham, so everything is in order from uh, a, a to Z or whatever, and I wanted to get a new Rockingham track just because maybe someday, I already knew a track I was going to get to, they have a night version actually, maybe I'll get that one instead. So you click the track, it's going to redirect you to a different website, and... Now I gotta figure out how to download it off this website. So go to download. I'm assuming yes, mediafire.com. You gotta be very careful when you get tracks from stuff because uh, all these advertisements could do bad things to your computer if you click it. The only right one is this one right here, and of course it's gonna pop up an advertisement. If you had AdBlock, it would automatically do it. I don't. So uh, just X out that thing. It should be downloading in the bottom left down here. And it's a RAR file. So uh, also, you're going to need 7-zip or a WinZip or Win WinRAR type of a thing. Um, I guess I'll show you how to download that too. Uh, I use 7-zip. And you just go here and download this if you don't have any way to get RAR files down here in the bottom left that we're downloading. Uh, download 32-bit um, if your computer is 32-bit or 64 for 64. If your computer is a little older, it's probably 32. If it's newer, within the last like two years, it's probably 64. I would assume you should know what it is, but yeah. So that's where you download that. Um, all right, so I can X out that now. So that is this website and how to download it for from uh, NR2003 Weebly. Next is Stunod Racing, which this place just took over the last maybe two or three years. And it's it's a must. Literally, you can get anything from here. Uh, bases for painting, car sets, mods, tracks, templates, logos, numbers, everything for painting a lot of stuff I want tracks right now so I'm just gonna pick a random track and I think there's a couple on here that I kinda wanted to try out I seen a Daytona one with no walls yeah this one right here I just wanna see what it's like to race a Daytona without any walls like do you just fly off the track or what so I'm gonna click on it uh, you have to be signed in to download and you'll have a download button right here this is a very safe website because it automatically downloads no pop-ups no nothing but you have to have an account and after you make an account it usually takes like one to three days to get verified or whatever uh, because whoever runs the website actually uh, has to uh, say yes to your account or whatever so this is a zip file any computer would do the zip files you don't need a uh, WinRAR or anything so now we got two tracks let's get one from FSB um, and then this is FSB. This isn't the, the home. I guess this is the home page of FSB. They got all sorts of different stuff, just like StuNod, but not quite as much. StuNod is like where everybody is able to do it. FSB is like their own company kind of does it. Uh, let's go to downloads. Um, BR Super Speedway. Uh, a lot of you guys were telling me to get Pig Creek. I don't even know what that is, so I'm going to download it. Oh, sweet, it automatically downloads. So this website will automatically do it too. So that's cool. So yeah, the first main one is all the realistic tracks, but it might be a little bit, if you don't know what you're doing, it might be riskier on your computer, but the other two definitely really fast. And then last but not least, I don't think I'm going to download a track off of here. 
But Wild Custom in Cars is really nice too. They got paved tracks right here. All different types of new paved tracks, natural fairgrounds, which is coming to NASCAR next season, I think, actually. Maybe I do need to download that. And then it's got dirt tracks, tons of dirt tracks, uh, different paint files for cars. And then, actually, this one has really good stuff because it has uh, all these different weird patches and stuff that can help you out. How to turn... This will allow you to force cautions yourself or put on random debris cautions. I should add that, but I haven't. Save game editor is very important. It allows you, so what I'm gonna do with my subscriber special is make my own starting lineup. So that's what save game editor does, is let you uh, change the starting lineups. Um, there's all different kinds of stuff. I'll, I'll go over all that. I think I'm, did I make a video for save game editor? If I haven't, um, I'll have to make one, but yeah. So those are the three main websites, or four main websites, I guess, that I use. There's there's tons of more, but you'll just have to look at those on your own. But once you have a track downloaded, like these three, um, I'll show you these two first because they're a lot easier. So I'm just gonna go down to my downloads. Sorry, I got so much stuff on my uh, on my thing. It's like crazy. So these are my three downloads, and this is my NR2003. So right click it, go to open file location on your NR2003, go to tracks, and it will be all your tracks right here. Then open up one of the zips, this is the Pig's Creek track, it has all the Pig's Creek stuff in there. All I gotta do, copy it and paste it in here, and boom, I have Pig's Creek. That's literally it. Um, next, Daytona No Wall. It's got a README file that you're supposed to read that will tell you like different things about it and uh, if they don't want you to use it for certain stuff without giving them credit or whatever, or edit the track. Uh, copy and paste it the same way. Did it go in there? There it is. So yeah. And then this one is a little harder since it is a RAR file. You can't open it, it won't let you. So you have to use a thing like 7-zip. And then I guess I'll show you. So 7-zip, WinRAR, WinZip, all those things are about the same. Most people have those downloaded because they have to use them for stuff. Uh, I forgot what that track was called. That was the Richmond one, or Rock 16 Duo. So now I look down for Rock 16 Duo in my downloads folder or wherever you downloaded it. Ooh, it's got a day and night in here. In fact, I'll do both. So. Uh, I'll highlight both of them, hit extract, then I will find my, and I'll show you how to do it on here, I'll find the folder for it, which it is in my, uh, let's see here, C, C is my hard drive, papyrus, tracks, like that, you gotta have tracks, hit OK, so it's C, papyrus, racing, NASCAR or Pyrus NASCAR Racing 2003 season and then tracks hit OK and it will extract it there. So I just got day and night. And then that should be it. I can exit out of there, I can exit out of there, I can exit out of here. And now I'll open up my NR 2003 and show you that those get, those tracks are there now. So, ooh, I have a little sneak peek, I guess, since I have um, the uh, 500 subscriber special. Um, heat race going on we'll uh we'll just show you what these guys are okay so here's no walls I'm not gonna qualify them because I don't want you guys to know the stats but uh, I see walls um, this might have been a gimmick drivers uh, to your car I see walls, so I don't know. Oh, there we go. No walls, so that's cool. Oh, jeez. Are those poles? Hopefully, you can go through those. But anyway, I don't want to show any too much of the, the racing on it. But yeah, see, so you can see that that has no walls. Um, what other track did I get? I got Richmond. Uh, you can have up to... Oh, there's Pig Creek. You can have up to 100... 
and 28 tracks at a time in your folder. After that, it will stop reading the bottom tracks like Watkins Glen and all that. So yeah. So here's Pig's Creek. I don't even know what it looks like, but it looks like it works too. Drivers, to your cars. So yeah, it looks like it's a super speedway, kind of like Daytona. But that's all I'm going to show with that. So we got Pig's Creek going. And last but not least, one, let's just do one of the uh, rocking hands. Let's do the night one. We'll show off one more heat race of cars. Sorry if you're in heat race four, you don't get showed off today. But uh, yeah. This is Rockingham Night. In fact, drivers are looking for that. Oh, geez. Yeah, the track I and I definitely needs change because <laughs> for 110, whatever. I got other tutorials showing you how to do that. But anyway, yeah, we got all the tracks. So, if this helped you out, please click the like button. Let me know in the comments below what else you want to learn. I'm probably going to do a painting tutorial and how to download car sets and all of that also. So yeah, uh, wow, that is crazy. Uh, don't forget to check out any of the other tutorials. I got a lot of stuff showing you how to rate them, how to change the tracks, do a bunch of different stuff, and we'll see you guys next time.